you're looking at a desktop 3D bioprinter. It's it's a device that builds three-dimensional living structures. Uh, we can use it to build miniature miniature organs that really mimic the function of real organs in the human body. And instead of testing new compounds on animals, we can begin to test them on these three-dimensional human tissues that really capture the way that the organs work. We took a portrait of Van Gogh and we uh, designed his ear off the portrait, flipped it over, and uh, recreated Van Gogh's, Van Gogh's ear. So this could actually be a fully, you know, a really a live ear. There's no uh, clinical case where something like this has been implanted. But it is it does get the point across of what you can do with technology and what the promise is. So this is an uh, interesting technology, very promising. Uh, printing cells, obviously at the end of the day we li like to make organs from cells. Print the heart, print a kidney. As this technology matures and as the space matures, uh, bioprinting is definitely going to be one of the technologies that plays into building uh, fully functional or replacement organs for patients with organ failures.